In this tutorial, we will be looking at genetic algorithms. Create a new frame in the exercises folder and rename it exercise underscore 2. Insert the objects shown. Now connect them and rename them. It is necessary to change the time of creation of the source since we are using a table to represent the arrival sequence of various requests. We need to enter our own values in the table. The delivery time for all the various colors should be zero since we are only addressing the setup time. I am selecting the MUs to be normal entities. However, you can choose your own custom MU if you'd like. The number is just how many of each color we want and this can be chosen at your own discretion. The names will just be a selection of different colors. Next, we will link the color matrix table file to the single proc by selecting matrix as the setup time method and by entering color matrix as the value. Now open the color matrix table and enter the value shown. These time values all represent the setup time for each color. Blue to black will have a setup time of 30 seconds, while black to black won't have a setup time. We would like to change the format of our table so that it is easier to follow and just looks better aesthetically. Setting up the GA wizard is the final step in our process. Drag and drop the arrival table onto the GA wizard while holding down the shift key. Ensure that the optimization direction is set to minimum. Now change the number of generations to 20 and the size of generation to 50. 
The higher these numbers, the longer your model will search for an optimal solution, and in most cases, the more accurate your solution will be. Upon opening the optimization parameter, you will notice that the arrival table is already linked. No added change is needed. The fitness calculation requires an attribute of some object to use, as this will be the attribute your model continuously tries to minimize. SimTime is an attribute that represents the total time the simulation is running. Minimizing this attribute would be ideal since we want the best sequence of colors that take the least amount of time to set up. Enter the value shown and change the weighting to 1. We are now ready to run our GA wizard. Go to the Run tab, click Reset and then Start. This is the HTML report generated by the GA wizard. The best solution of the sequence problems show the order in which the various colors should arrive to minimize the simulation time. The graph depicts how the algorithm generated new values based on the fitness of the previous values and how your model eventually tends to an optimal solution. Sometimes your solution will seem like a global optimum, but if you increase the number and the size of the generations by enough, it will tend to a new optimal, which will likely be closer, if not exactly, to your global optimum. 